Hi friends, in my previous session I have explained how to create uh, cutout operations for Spring REST uh, web application. So in this session I am going to explain uh, how, how to use uh, annotations like uh, matrix variable, then path variable, uh, we already seen path and query params that is called in Spring it is request uh, param and uh, headers, the request headers. So uh, I'm going to uh, use request uh, param in Jaxrs. It is equivalent to uh, uh, query param. So it's a get call. So I'm using get mapping. This is for uh, query uh, string, so I'm using query. For query param, we'll be using the annotation called request param in Spring World. I'm giving it as query param name is a uh, query param is key value pair. So I am giving key name as English and value will be coming in the uh, value argument. So if we are using only one uh, query param we can use uh, at the rate request param with uh, key name and value. If you want to take multiple uh, query params we can directly go with map, map of string uh, value, a string comma string. So I am, so in this uh, here I am going to use uh, query param map, so get mapping. query map so I will be using the same annotation but it will instead of giving key and value separately I will be taking it as a map request param And apart from uh, query params, path params, we have something called matrix params. So uh, I want to use matrix params here. Uh, first, I'll be go I want to use a single matrix param, like query param, how we have used for one argument. Similarly, for matrix param, we can use. So it's a get call. In Spring, uh, matrix param always follow with URI template pattern. So it should always uh, be after uh, path param. So I have taken path param as int uh, id. Otherwise, we'll be getting 400 mi uh, missing uh, uh, argument. So path variable. The, uh, the URI is. slash matrix slash id so here id is path param so it's a path variable and in this string is the our matrix param matrix param also holds key value pair so if you want to use same name, uh, we, can, we have no need to give the uh, key value. If key and uh, value names are same, we have no need to use. So it's matrix variable. So I'm just giving French. And value name also French. Even if I'm not giving this French also, it will be able to take uh, French equal to that corresponding uh, value. Uh, Query param we can convert it to uh, a string. Uh, string it can be converted to any wrapper value, but in case of matrix param, it always uh, takes only string argument, string value. So that's why I have used here string, and I was converting that string to integer. If I want to take multiple matrix params, I can use a map. So I 
all it's a path variable I'll use matrix variable so I'm going to start my application So it started in 8085. First, I'll try with query param. For uh, query, we are using query, and uh, it's a key value pair. After colon, we'll be giving the key value and pair. Value I'm giving 80. So the results which is greater than 80 will be printed here. If I want to take a multiple uh, query param, we have used query map. In this condition, we were only checking for English value. So apart from English, I'll be checking. Mul we'll be using and for uh, in between uh, more than one uh, query param. Hindi equal to. Uh, equal to eight. So we are able to retrieve uh, all the results which is greater than 80. Uh, we have tested query param. Now I will go with uh, matrix param or matrix variable in spring. We are using uh, id and matrix will be starting with the colon. The key value will be differentiated with the uh, semicolon. So here it is saying missing matrix variable French. Even though we have given colon uh, French equal to 40, it is not taking. Because by default, uh, Spring will not uh, take uh, semicolon in the URI. So for that, we need to add some uh, config class called M. Uh, web mvc config configurer and we have to implement uh, that uh, set uh, semicolon to true by default it is false uh, uh, true we have to make it true uh, false so that it can be uh, taken from the uri so now i'm going to create one uh, configuration class So it's a configuration class. I need to use at the rate configuration. And it, it implements Spring Web MVC configurer. Input. If you go inside this, we'll be finding something called path match configure. We need to provide implementation for this for our path to take from the semicolon values so I'm using this path public void and the rate override so we'll be using URL path uh, helper URL path helper called to new URL hel path helper.
your helper dot set remove semicolon content if you see by default by default it is true so that's why it is not removing the semicolon it is not able to find the matrix paragraph so we are going to make it false and we are adding it to configure it's here helper So it was having same name that's why it's giving cyclic dependency so i will change it to web config mvc config i'll rename my classes web mvc config now if i restart my server uh, my matrix param should be able to work so application is started so let me go and hit See, we got this value, but the results was empty. Marks French was uh, the last one. And this it was not in this. So let me. Uh, now I'll go with matrix map. If any value is greater than particular condition, it will be trying to use. So I am taking matrix map. Uh, currently, it was looking for uh, uh, ID one and which is not having a uh, French equal to uh, forty. That's why it was returning empty results. So now I'll go with uh, first. I'll return uh, what is the results for that one? So English hundred, uh, Hindi eighty eight and uh, three. So I'll go with matrix map. Slash one colon English equal to hundred. So I'll give fifty colon Hindi equal to fifty math equal to fifty. So if any one condition is true, it was able to retrieve data. Here, all these key value pair will be stored in the map as a uh, st st map string comma string. So apart from this uh, query uh, request param and uh, matrix variable, we have some uh, we can uh, send the headers also using request headers. So in this same example, I'll add request headers in the matrix map. a single header we can give the uh, header name and uh, value and we can give default value also if that header is not present it will take the default value example I am giving x hyphen uh, match
default value equal to I am giving uh, test123 and it's a string string header value so I'll just print it here just for demo purpose header value of x match this is when you are using a single header if I want to take multiple headers same way I can use map or multi value map so in this example I'll give header map string header values so here I will just print all the headers for map dot entry string comma string and equal to header dot entry set string so it's just printing for demo purpose key is head dot get key value is head dot get value so I'll restart the server and I'll test that header values so my server is started so first I'll go with this and I'm not passing any header apart from content type so I have not passed text match but it should be able to give the default value because we have used default value similarly I will go with this second uh, if I give some value it will be taking that uh, given value if I say default 1 2 3 4 when I hit if I go to so we will be able to take the value given if no value is present it will take the default so now I'll check the uh, map of header values I'm going to postman I'll pass some other headers x conversation id One, two, three, four, five, six, and one more header. It's uh, API key test. So we should be able to retrieve three map values in our uh, apart from uh, accept and coding. These are the default headers which will be the uh, coming from the spring rest. Apart from that, whatever the headers we have passed was coming. Uh, Thank you friends.